what's up team? So really needed to create this video today to show you one of our best legs and butt circuits that we have in our armory. It's awesome because it's time efficient. You're gonna burn tons of calories, your legs and butt are gonna feel like they've never felt before and it's great if you're on the move or you're at home. So get yourself warm and let's do it. Right, time to crack on. First thing we're gonna do, 30 seconds of squats. So you'll all know how to do squats. I'm not gonna suck eggs. If you've got a sofa at home, absolutely brilliant. Lay all of your weight down, keep your heels down and squeeze up through the butt. That's one of the main things that people forget. When they're trying to activate their glutes, they don't even think about them. So concentrate your pressure there. Extend the hips and tense the butt. 30 seconds, nice and simple. Watch the knees as well. This is my easy day. Done. We've got five seconds, we're going to go straight into our first cardio exercise. So bring it down to the floor. Hill climbs. So we're not going to mess about. We want to get a nice high speed and bring your knees up so you can see them next to your fingertips every time. Keep the butt nice and low. Keep it going. And this is only the first set of 10. So your heart rate should be nice and high. Keep pushing guys. I did get told actually last time that it sounded a bit weird with all my heavy breathing. Two, one, and relax. So you've got a 10 second break. Make sure you take some nice deep breaths if you want to. Sit down, but you'll need that in about 10 minutes. So we're gonna go for some split lunges. Foot up, bring it down, bury the knee all the way down. Keep the chest up, drive up through your front heel. After 15 seconds, you're gonna switch legs. So keep your chest up, heel down. Keep it going. I think we've got time for another couple before we switch. And turn it around. Step back, toes down. Oh, and then fall over. And push all the way up. All right, five seconds. We'll get another one in there. And again. And then if you can, hands down on the bench. And it's going to be a hill climb. But because I've got a different bench, I'm going to switch. So if you've got the option, this is where I want you to be stretching that back leg out every time. If not, you can always just do the hill climbs again. So keep it going, keep the core tight, belly button, belly button, belly button sucked in nice and high. And relax it off, well done. Right, so let's get a little bit of jumpy jumpy going. Turn it side on, plyo lunge. Chest up, switch, nice and high. Bring the arms in to balance the body a little bit more. 30 seconds of this, it's gonna suck. Remember if it gets a little bit tough, you are more than welcome to step back and switch. But like I said, this is gonna be hard. Keep it going. And switch, bring it down to the floor. Squat thrust. This is where your quads are gonna start to burn. So stay with me. How are we all doing? Keep it going. You're working towards your next break. Ah, nearly there. Five seconds, two more, one. And relax. Good stuff. Really good stuff. Lay yourself down. I'm going to be unsociable for a minute. Arms down. Legs straight. Drive all the way up. Push that butt up to the ceiling. If you can't do this on a bench at home or the sofa, option. Just push up off the floor. 15 seconds. And then switch. Leg out straight. Really driving that heel down and belly button up towards the sky. Keep it going. Five seconds. Right, next up, this is gonna suck. Feet up, chest up, and march through. Keeping the chest high, butt high. Point the toes. Keep it going. Should start to feel your butt screaming at you now. You got about 12 seconds left. Keep it going. Another break coming up in five, 
four, three, two, one. Back to half, well done. Feel free to stay down there if you want to for a second, but not if you're me. Sumo jump squats. From there, take it wide, up onto the toes, straight in. So this minute is gonna be hard. The exercise on its legs alone is gonna spike your heart rate. And then, just for good measure, add on a really tough cardio exercise. Keep it going, keep your chest up, turn your knees out, five seconds, and change. Bring it down now to a baby jump squat, and hold, shoot your chest up as if you're catching a ball, sit into the heels, and turn the knees out and the toes out. If it's too hard, step in, step back, step in, and just roll the forearms up. Oh, now my bum's starting to scream. And my legs, nearly there. Woo! Oh, that's hurting. Right, eccentric loading, single leg squats now. Leg up, down slow. Drive all the way up, down slow. Drive up, really good for core stability knee stability and the quads. Gonna switch it round, push up, down. Drive up through the heel every time. Oh, five seconds. Time for two more. One, two. Right, we're going down, all the way down, all the way up. Keep the legs nice and straight. Activate the hamstrings. Push the bum high. Oh, how are we doing for time, Jono? Ooh. Keep it going, guys. Push up. Last one. Just for the measure. Now relax it off. Hope you're staying with me, guys. Quick shake of the legs. Right, curtsy lunge. Arms out. Sweep it round, and then the other way. Keep that knee facing forward. Stretch the back leg out. If you can only go just behind, that's absolutely fine. Work over time to build up the range, and eventually, if you've got the balance, point the toes out underneath the movement. This really good for the glutes. Three seconds left. Let's bring the heart rate up a little bit. Legs down, up, and in and out, and elevated squat thrust. This is gonna suck. So dig deep. If it's too hard, step up every time. But you're here to work, remember that. Oh, now they're hurting. Oh, oh. Oh my days, that was not fun. It was really not fun. Oh. Right, squat and raise. Down, lift, down, lift. Push the knee away from the body to get the core working. And up. So if you've made it this far, you've done really well. You should be proud but you've still got some way to go. Oh. Five seconds, stay with me. All right, now jump squat, touch down. Up, up, up. Remember, if this gets too tough, squat down, drop the chest a little bit lower, and don't bend the legs so much, because by now, your quads should be burning. But stay there. Push, push, this is hurting a hell of a lot now. Oh, five seconds, four, three, two, one. Oh, no, can't go again. All right, so wide, lean over, down, push. This is really good for improving your mobility in your hips 
and work in your hamstrings and quads. If you tense the quads at the stretch of the movement, and keep your chest up. Take a few deep breaths. Keep pushing. Stretch across. Really feel those hips open up. Right, five seconds. We're gonna take it in with some side to side squat thrusts. From the middle, out, middle, out. Keep the butt up. If it gets too hard, step out both ways. Hold on. Here comes the sweat. Here comes the heart rate. Nearly there. Come on. Push. Woo. Oh. oh my days. I don't even know how many rounds we've got left. Last round. Oh. This is gonna suck. Right, so we're going back to the start. Squat. Hold it. Three, two, one. Drive. Down. Hold it. Three, two, one. Up. And again, this is where you've really got to switch those glutes on. Force the hips forward. Lift the chest up. Down. Try not to take the break at the top. If it's too hard, it's a quick shake. But don't. It's your last round of work. Right. Let's bring the mother in. One, up, stand, lift. Right, you've got around 20 seconds of work. If you can, stay with me for three. Up, two, up, and again. One more for luck. Oh dear. Nearly there, guys, come on. Oh, smashed it. Well done. Really well done, see? 10 minutes, tons of calories, quads, hamstrings burning, butt burning, heart pounding out my chest. Well done, team. Fuck. So we've talked about your nutrition and your hydration. So let's talk about your exercise. It doesn't really matter whether you're lifting weights to build muscle